And you know, high winds of late have been putting some delays on some of the many road construction projects around the KWW viewing area of eastern Iowa. With that in mind, let's go live right now to KWW's Ashton Neighbor talking to the Iowa Department of Transportation today about what they're dealing with. And Ashley Forrest right now is live in Waterloo with some of the latest. Well, that's right. The concern is no longer snow and ice. It's actually now wind and rain. While that might not sound very serious when it comes to weather, it's actually causing delays for construction. Take a look here at the new underpass for the Viking Road and Highway 58 intersection in Cedar Falls that's set to go in. This is one of those projects that's being delayed. You can see the temporary traffic signs really swaying in the wind, and the Iowa DOT tells me that it's actually the cause for the delay. The wind has been so strong, workers cannot get into the crane to rewire the lights for the change in traffic. If you use a crane or some kind of boom truck, and you know they're they're only holding onto it at certain points, and the wind's wind's gonna. Um, make it more difficult and less safe for them to, to complete that. Utility contractors working on the project also said since the traffic lights couldn't go up, they couldn't paint the new road lines. Now with the possibility of rain coming in, they may have missed their mark, their time to paint the roads this week. So the Iowa DOT says if you're going to go in that area, seek alternative routes as it will um, continue to be congested. Live in Blackhawk County, Ashley Neighbor, News 7, KWWL. Ashley, thanks very much. Yeah, that is a very, very busy highway out in that part of town for sure. Now for more information on some of the alternative routes that you can take or just to track the uh, construction progress in this area. All you have to do is visit this story on our website, kwwl.com.